only 18 U.S. states require sexual health program content to be medically accurate. Only 20 U.S. states and D.C. require that information be provided on contraception. 39 states and D.C. require that information be provided on abstinence. That's great. You want to give the option. However, 29 states require that abstinence be stressed. There's a difference between covering abstinence as a valid choice and stressing that abstinence abstinence is the correct or the better option. Only 10 U.S. states and D.C. require inclusive content with regard to sexual orientation. We don't have enough people who are passing these laws who have experience with comprehensive sexual health education even though there is an abundance of research that show that when young people have access to age-appropriate, comprehensive, medically accurate sex education in the places where that's the norm, the STI rate decreases, the unplanned pregnancy rate decreases, and the inverse is true. We know that where there's abstinence-only education, STI rates skyrocket and unplanned pregnancy rates skyrocket. 